Broncos powerhouse Tavita Panga Jr. has stolen the spotlight in the QLD Derby, devastating the Cowboys with an unrelenting physicality to see Brisbane to a 29-10 victory at Suncorp Stadium. When Tavita Pangai Jr. is running around on this field, I want nothing of it, said Billy Slater on Nine's NRL commentary team, and it's a feeling that would have been rife amongst the visitors on Friday night. After an emphatic display in Townsville not six days ago, the highly touted Cowboys front pack yielded to the brutality of the 115 kilograms Tongan who was first off the line to meet every tackle on almost every occasion. The most telling of which was an early heavy hit on North Queensland favourite Jason Taumalola who was folded back awkwardly on his right knee, in an ailment which he never seemed to recover from. Tavita Panga Jr. powers past the Cowboys, AAP, he's going to be an immortal one day, and I just really respect his game, Panga Jr. said of Taumalolo on 9's Friday night knockoff, I grew up watching his game, he played with my brother and I have a lot of respect for him, he's the king of Tonga. In another worry, for Cowboys coach Paul Green, winger Nene McDonald and utility John Aziot also failed to finish the match with head knocks, forcing a backline reshuffle that at one stage left second rower Mitch Dunn at pivot. Panga was relegated to the bench in Brisbane's first round loss to Melbourne after battling back from a hamstring injury. Broncos celebrate victory over Cowboys, AAP, however, the live wire forward looked like he wanted to prove a point after being thrown a starting front row berth by new coach Anthony Seibold, stepping up for the suspended Matt Lodge. He played like a man possessed, pulling off hit after hit to leave North Queensland shell-shocked from the outset and finished with a total of 115 metres while also helping himself to a 47th minute try. Center James Roberts proved he was over a back injury that cut short his first-round clash, nabbing a try-scoring double along with winger Corey Oates. The Broncos grabbed a 10-0 halftime lead before kicking on with Oates scoring his 12th try in six games and Roberts helping himself to the eighth double of his career. Tavita Panga Jr.'s man of the match performance had finally broke Seibold's winning duck with the Brisbane Reigns as the hosts claimed their seventh win in eight games against North Queensland at Suncorp Stadium. North Queensland didn't get on the board until ex-Bronco Jordan Kahu crashed over in the 60th minute with AAP.